Oh my goodness, it has a tremendous benefit when it comes to the students. It gives them the opportunity to take the theory that they practice in classroom and put the theory into practice. It also lets them know that everything that we talk about in social work, like ethics and meeting people where they are, it puts a face on, on, on everything that we speak about. It, it gives them an opportunity to go into the community and to make a difference. Um, we can teach them everything in the classroom, and that is so critically important. But until they work with clients and they see how it feels to be on the side of, of to be a recipient and how we you know, have to practice being um, careful with information and confidentiality, until they really experience that, they really don't understand the essence of, of being a, a social worker that's effective. We're here for res like help you with resources, um, any kind of whether that's um, applying for jobs or applying for social services like applications, um, even like finding homeless shelters. Like we're here and this is the library, it's like the hub. Um, and especially we're here right now at the Penn North Library where unfortunately in Baltimore City, Charm City, it's always been um, systematically oppressed. So the fact that we are here at the library, hopefully it'll be about empowering. So that's my goal <laughs> as trying, you know, my goal in all of this. It's a great experience learning about different agencies. Um, we have to connect these people to what's in their community. So we're also learning about what resources are out there, what agencies are out there, and how to connect these people. There were a group of teens in the library after school one afternoon, and they were being kind of loud, but just teenage loud. Um, so I approached them, introduced myself as a library social worker, and just started asking them questions about themselves, the neighborhood, and from there we just started talking. Um, they were happy to engage, happy to um, tell me about their community, and as a result, we asked, I asked them if they'd be interested in starting a team group at the library. So that's what we're going to do. The value of this experience for me is almost immeasurable in a sense. You know, to be able to, I've spent already a full year in the classroom and learning about theory and learning about human behavior and learning about research and it's a lot of book work and it's interesting and it's fascinating but like with reading with any education any profession you always start to wonder okay I've got the knowledge and I understand what's going on here but <laughs> how does that translate in practice when I sit down with a client am I going to have any idea what to do what to say how to behave how to interact and to have this experience for myself to sit down with clients interact with them learn from them, you know, have them help me, have me help them, and that back and forth I think is really going to be a huge piece, really integral piece for myself as I you know, go through the process of social work student to social work professional. And without this kind of field experience, I don't think that will be possible.